Right. So now coming uh, to Naveen, Naveen, how would you like to explain how these two uh, technologies can be optimized? How the integration can be made seamless? When it comes to integration, uh, it's all about data. So data is a central point for integrating these two technologies. Uh, and basically starts off with identifying various uh, classes of data and its life check. Uh, for instance, let's say for businesses and enterprises, uh, data is all data in states, right? It's used to establish trust and compliance between parties and for optimizing the businesses. For consumers, it would be providing, let's say, a better experience, personalized engagements, and even authentic authenticity of data, right? Where uh, we are identifying fake news, price, or an event. And for systems, data would be crucial to establish uh, the trust and compliance for an autom autonomous functionality between devices. Let's say where all the devices are connected, right, uh, in an IoT world. And if you look at each of these use cases, right, blockchain can be used to provide the trust, compliance, and track the complete life cycle of a product. And, in, and an AI system can help analyze the data and ensure there is no disambiguity in the data and the process is not biased. For, to give you an example, uh, uh, we had used AI and blockchain to boost uh, supply chain transparency and uh, efficiency in a coffee uh, industries. So what we did was using artificial intelligence and uh, computer vision technology, we created a deep learning network to identify various uh, classes of coffee beans and basically grade them. And based on the prediction and the outcome that we got, the output was recorded in the blockchain and the entire life cycle uh, was tracked from C to finished product without any ambiguity and most importantly, without any human bias. Because whenever the humans are involved, right, you have judge, you have various judgmental identifying the various class of coffee beans. And that, that's how uh, the various price modifications uh, come into play. So having an AI expert or a system in place eliminates uh, the ambiguity and potentially any human bias. Uh, other example I like to cite is, let's say, uh, let's take an example of a complex uh, B2B process, for instance, uh, a trade finance application. Now, uh, to carry out any international trade, several parties or organizations needs to coordinate with each other. They basically include uh, buyers, sellers, uh, bank bank, uh, bank guarantees, shipping logistics firms, port, and various custom authorities. And if you look at the process, uh, it's basically time consuming. It's quite inefficient. And most importantly, there is lack of any visibility right around the entire process because each party uh, to the trade right maintains their own source of information. So what there is no basically a shared consensus and often arises lack of trust, especially if, if the buyer and seller are quite new. So how does blockchain and AI can help in this scenario? So using blockchain, basically a marketplace model, right, can be developed where trading can happen through shared consensus uh, by the various parties and provide consensus and accountability, right, thereby reducing the time of trade maybe from days to hours. Uh, Using artificial intelligence, uh, we can basically match right uh, prospective sellers with buyers based on buyer requirements, ratings, and the past trade. So, since we have all the transactions available in blockchain, basically an AI system can be built right. We basically identify the transactions and identify any anomalies as part of it. And especially if you're a new buyer, a recommendation system can be built right. It pick, picks up. Uh, the best rated sellers and trusted parties, right? And provide optimization of trade based, based on similar requirements. Now, if you go a step further, uh, you can be also employ technologies like IoT, right? Which can be automatically track goods and shipments at various intervals. So what you could do is uh, based, you could basically log uh, all the GPS coordinates, right? And you can have a smart contract uh, defined which basically logs all the ledger transactions um, uh, in your blockchain. So if you look at it, uh, there are various endless possibilities, right? So on, on how one can leverage and, and combine these two technologies and definitely backed by consensus through blockchain, right? For delivering next generation intelligent products. Right. So uh, now we have 